or much more still to come on the show. Don't go anywhere after this break. We've got some incredible live music right here in the studio. You're watching Studio Expo. Welcome back to Studio Expo and thanks for staying with us. Now we'd like you to use the hashtag Studio Expo to let us know what your thoughts are on the show today. Only nice ones please. <laughs> including your thoughts on our next very special guest. Absolutely. Now we've got the French-American artist Sylvain Pallier here to perform with us in the studio. And we're very excited because you've brought us something very special today. You're going to be performing with hand pans. That's correct, Katie. Thank you, Lee. Thanks for having me. My pleasure. Uh, the hand pan is a baby in the world instrumentarium. This means uh, um, it's just entering this, this uh, family of musical instruments. It was invented in Switzerland in the year 2000. Originally it was called the Hang, H-A-N-G. And then as it was growing globally um, there was a need for a new term and the term hand pen was chosen. Not, it's not coincidental that it was chosen because the hand pen is a sibling of the steel pen from the Caribbean, from the islands of Trinidad and Tobago. It's made out of steel. It's a, a very simple object by design. It's made out of two half shells, two steel bowls that are glued together. And then on the top of the instruments, you can find uh, small indentations. We call them dimples. And these are the musical notes, like you would have on any other musical instrument. Uh, do, re, mi, fa, sol. Um, and, um, and so hand pans are tuned to specific scales. You don't have all the notes that you would have on a piano or on a guitar. You have a select few notes that give you a special mood. And uh, it might be a Middle Eastern mood, it might be an Asian mood. Um, and so as you put the hand pan on your lap, you enter a, a sonic world with its own flavors. Why was it created? I mean, how did it come to be? I mean, obviously it's fairly new, as you said, in 2000. Mm -hmm. So why was it created? How was it created? And how, because you don't just stumble upon something like that. There's two individuals, uh, the inventors of this instrument, who had been experimenting for more than 20 years. And they created uh, prototypes of all shapes and forms. And this, stuck. This clicked, I think, with musicians. It's, uh, they, they say it's the size of an embrace. It's um, <laughs> the pitch range of the human voice. Okay. And uh, it just worked. You know, it's one of those things um, that just stayed. I mean, we heard you rehearsing earlier. It is beautiful and quite popular for sound meditation as well. We're going to be coming to a special performance with you in just a minute. But first, thank you so much for tuning in today. We hope you've enjoyed today's show as much as we have. Lee, lovely to be presenting with you again. As always, yeah, great show and enjoyed it immensely. Um, it's been great fun. We're going to be back tomorrow as always. But uh, over to the wonderful Sylvain now, who's going to play us out with something that you're going to... We know you're going to love it. So <laughs> take a listen. Over to you, Sylvain. Thank you both. Thank you. 